What's up folks, it's Keith coming at you on a Monday night. Gonna do a little product review video and it's super ghetto on the kitchen floor. But uh my product review is about Amazonas magazine. Which for those of you who haven't read this magazine, it's a very high quality magazine. I would definitely recommend it to anybody. Um but I would say that it's probably geared towards the more advanced hobbyist. Um, they cover a lot of kind of rare species, talk about breeding angels, um, they do a lot of like nice tank spotlights. Uh, this was like a riparium some guy in uh, I think Oakland or something did. Um, you know they get crazy, they go out, this is like wild glossostigma growing in the desert somewhere where there's a dead bone. Um, what's this one? This is like some sort of, uh, what is that? Some sort of hair grass or something, but they, the article says it's in four inches of water. Um, so they're catching, like, lots of plants for you plant enthusiasts. You know, they're checking them out in their native environment. These guys are going to the places, catching all these crazy fish. Um, you know, they do good, good little, nicely, uh, done articles with really cool aquascapes. They do a lot of coverage of the aquascape contests. This article is just all about nanos. Um, but they really come with the like really bomb aquascape. Um, you know, here's a whole article on scarlet baddis. That was kind of a hot fish that came out a couple years back. You know, it really started blowing up and everyone had to have them. Um, so this really is a good quality magazine. You know, there's another tank spotlight. I think this is like a 30 gallon tank or something like that. Um, you know, you got all your shrimp coverage, talk about the different shrimps, this whole magazine, this one, issues dedicated to shrimps, uh, they got stuff for you cichlid lovers, uh, this whole, art, this one's all about trophius, which is kind of a cool fish, um, but they're actually like filming these things live, taking pictures live in their native environments, and writing articles about it, so it's a little bit more about the traveling of the world, and the passion of the fish keeping kind of twisted up with uh, the really you know super serious aquascaping and stuff like that so if you haven't had a chance check out Amazonas magazine um, I find mine at Barnes and Noble that's really the only place I've seen it besides my local fish store but uh, you could probably get at them online or something like that Amazonas Man magazine check it out and that is your uh, product review for this evening thank you